studies are pretty clear that stretching before a run doesn't do you any good at all and may actually uh, decrease your performance, surprisingly. Well, every time you hit the ground, the force underneath your foot's about two and a half times your body weight. So you do that about each foot three times a second. It's a lot of pounding. I've been running for about 35 years and uh, I've never had a running related injury. As far as avoiding injuries, I suppose the most important thing is not to increase your running mileage too rapidly. They gradually increase. Taking uh, hard days and easy days, don't try to run the same distance every day. I'm a big advocate of running on soft surfaces. This dirt road here is not too bad. I'm lucky enough to live in Colorado so I can run on trails out in my backyard. Uh, and if you have to choose between asphalt and concrete, probably asphalt's better. But if you can find any kind of a trail or park, I would recommend that. Starting a stretching program and sticking with it that you do after you run or some other time of the day, probably a good idea. Boulder's a great place to run. It's, uh, the weather's outstanding. Probably the nicest weather of any place I've ever lived. It's a great place to run. Best place I've ever run.